Well, everybody, here is our organized chaos. Uh, we are preparing to head out to contentment for the summer and begin working on our off-grid property. And this is just part of what's going, <laughs> our piles. We've got lots and lots of uh, food that we've canned. Uh, pantry's full and ready. We have more ground beef than we know what to do with, don't yes. we, Robert? What did we get? Like 72 jars, and I have 10 jar, uh, uh, quarts of chicken. We bought 80 pounds of roast beef, and that made 72 pints. Oh, uh, not yeah. roast beef, ground beef. Ground beef. And that made uh, 72 pints or 72 pounds worth of cooked ground beef. I'm so, so yeah. glad that, the, um, that we're done with the... Uh, automotive slash backhoe stuff here. I'm beginning to get the shop back, but as you can see, I didn't really get it back. I got the woodworking tools back, but as you can see, everything's just piled in here, and we've got so much uh, to do, to still do, to put together. Um, and so we've still got our work ahead of us, and according to our planned schedule, we're supposed to be out of here uh, in one week from today. We're supposed to be on our way to contentment one week from today. Boy, I don't know if it's going to happen. It's going to be all we can do to get Dinah ready to move, and then we may be slightly behind. So, anyway, just thought I'd show you our chaos, and, uh, and we're getting ready to go to contentment. Just thought I'd show you our transport out to contentment. <laughs> this is all we're going to be able to take, it turns out. No, just kidding. Pretty much. Yeah. Might as so. well be. You'll remember, uh, in our last video, we mentioned that my truck died. And that uh, <clears throat> we had a little setback on that, which meant we were going to have to come back in a couple of weeks and switch out vehicles and things like that. Well... My warranty on the truck does offer a loaner vehicle, but it does not permit us to take it out of state. So, unfortunately, we do not have a truck to tow Buzz, the mobile solar generator, out to contentment. That has really stuck a little kink in our plans, uh, which means that uh, unless, you know, somebody out of the kindness of their heart feels like towing a 2,800 pound uh, solar generator about 600 miles and then driving back about 600 miles empty and would like to do that for us out of the uh, kindness of their heart, then Buzz is going to have to stay here for probably a month. That means that uh, we're going to be eating pork and beans and Vienna sausages out of cold cans for a while because we won't be able to cook uh, with at least using electricity and we won't be able to run our tools that we wanted to for building the superintendent shack uh, we won't have electricity for things like this you know <laughs> we were afraid that the problem would be and I guess everybody else was you know our skeptics the problem would be that this solar generator wouldn't supply the power that we needed out there to get things done. Well, it appears that's not the problem at all. The problem now is going to be getting it out there uh, because, uh, you know, we just don't have a truck. But, you know, here's our choice. Either we stay out here for a month twiddling our thumbs during the summer doing nothing, or we get to contentment and do what we can and then just come back in a month and get buzz. So... Your thoughts, Robber? Um, I have none. <laughs> I have to be... Well, never mind. Say it. <sighs> it's going to be very primitive, mm -hmm. and um, I guess it'll be fun. It's an adventure. I have to think of it that way. So, we're going to put as much food as we can in this thing. And then, of course, we have a 40-foot trailer that's taking Dinah. And we're going to load as much of this stuff uh, as we can uh, into crates on that. But here's some of the stuff that's going. Most of that in there is not going. 
Uh, of course, we're just, you know, we're just making a mess out here, cleaning things and getting them ready to go. Um, we have our little contentment wagon over here that we would like to take if we can find room on the on the trailer for it. There's the seat for the back hoe, and um, you know, just stuff. We have to take a couple of ladders in order to get some work done. And I'll show you what else we've got stacked up here for our trip. Place is an absolute mess. Please forgive. Um, but uh, yeah, so there is just stuff, stuff, stuff everywhere. And we're thinking, we're hoping we can fit all of this into about, oh, four crates. Um, load them on the truck, then fill them. Because when we get to contentment, we won't have a forklift or anything like that to unload with. We're going to have to hand load, hand unload. And so it's going to be lots of fun.